Dr. Evelyn Yates, personal identification number 92225C, recording from Black Site, 51 degrees 30 minutes, 47.7 seconds north, 0 degrees 8 minutes, 51.9 seconds west. We don't have full confirmation, but it appears that the experiment to send a human being through the time fracture was a failure. Sergeant Dudley is missing. And though we hope that we will be able to recover him from the fracture, that outcome is looking increasingly unlikely. As you can see, since the experiment, the time factor has continued to grow at an alarming rate. And we have intercepted communication from security organizations around the world reporting time anomalies increasing in both frequency and scale. This danger is real. It is growing and something within the time fracture is responsible. Obviously, at this moment, another human being venturing inside is out of the question. We now understand that the fracture is far too unstable. The energy is within too potent for anyone to travel through unaided. But there is a solution. Using the technology of the Vortex Manipulator salvaged from the Black Archive, I've drawn up designs for a portal stabilization gateway. A PSG. A device that would balance and maintain the energies of the time fracture to provide, in theory, someone with the opportunity to travel in, safe and uncompromised. Someone who knows what they're getting themselves into. Exactly. We must insist that whoever is chosen to make this journey should do so with full possession of the facts. They should know what happened to Sergeant Dudley and that we're working in uncharted territory. They should be volunteers. On who those volunteers should be, well, someone had a suggestion. This next part is rather... I mean, in normal circumstances, it would be odd, considering everything else that's going on. The Doctor's private channel for encrypted communication came online with this message. Did you get my shoes? I told you they were their shoes. The message. It says... Operation Time Fracture. Which, if you were to approve this as an operation and wanted to name it, it's... A bit on the nose. It's obvious. But it does what it says on the tin. And then, then, the rest of the message is just names. A list of names. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of them. We don't know what these names mean, but considering the timing of this correspondence... And considering the source. They should be considered very seriously indeed. Which brings us to you. The information you've just seen is not for civilian eyes. My name is Kate Lethbridge-Stewart. I'm the former Chief Scientific Officer of the Unified Intelligence Task Force. I have broken every security protocol we have to show you these recordings. But I've done this because someone very important to me, my family and, well, the survival of the Earth, they think you have an important part to play in this operation. Your name is on the list, which means we need you. So consider this your invitation to step up and save the universe. I know you won't let us down. <laughs> Don't forget to click below and subscribe to the official Doctor Who YouTube channel.